We always like to talk about how 1970 was one of the peak years of the muscle car era, and one of the reasons why is because cars like this, 1970 Pontiac Trans Am, you know, in that year, uh, the Camaro and the, and the Firebird both received complete makeovers, became completely different cars, a little more sophisticated, a little better handling, and this package is really a classic. This is a numbers matching L74, 400 cubic inch or 6.6 .6 liter, uh, Ram Air 3 V8. Uh, it's 335 horsepower coupled with the three-speed automatic, uh, four shift center console, bucket seats, that great Trans Am steering wheel, the engine turn dash. When you got into this car, you really felt like you were in a performance vehicle, even when you weren't driving fast because the handling was really uh, precise, the suspension's nice and taut on it, and this is a great car. This is the correct polar white and the blue striping. Uh, it shows about 89,000 miles on the clock, but the restoration is fresh, uh, right around the 500 mile mark, and it's got the correct wheels. Uh, the undercarriage is immaculate, the engine compartment, everything is beautiful. The interior, black bucket seats, it really, uh, presents as a new car. Uh, the Firebird symbols on here, that uh, rear-facing shaker hood scoop, which was new for the Trans Am that year. This car's got all those cues, and the spoiler package was actually functional for this car to run in Trans Am racing. It had the air extractors on the side, pretty big front spoiler, and for the time, that spoiler on the back was very radical, but Pontiac uh, showed us in the advertising that that was a functional piece, that it gave it downforce. Uh, the aerodynamics on the car really got stepped up. And this is a great example. Polar white, like we said, numbers matching engine and transmission. It's the L74 6.6 .6 liter, 400 cubic inch uh, engine that everybody loves, runs and starts, rides great. So let's hear it right now.